This 5 minute video illustrates our experience on laser treatment of facial veins. There are many types of facial veins. Those veins can be treated safely with modern transdermal lasers. Selective photothermolysis. This experiment displays the photothermolysis very well. In fact, transdermal lasers work so well nowadays that only the vessels are affected while the skin is spared. Among a list of transdermal lasers, three wavelengths are to be noted due the coefficient of absorption of oxy and deoxyhemoglobin. This graphic shows the peaks of absorption. The regular orange curve demonstrates the absorption curve of the melanin. Sun exposure determines the increase of absorption on shorter wavelengths, which is demonstrated by the shifting in the graphic. The laser we use nowadays is the new 1064 Harmony. We prefer bigger spot sizes for being easier to aim and safer to the skin. Due to the energy scattering that forms an inverted cone of diffusion, bigger spot sizes allow for lower fluent settings and less shots. The vein viewer enables the visualization of feeder veins that are too deep for the naked eye and yet too shallow for ultrasound detection. It also gives the practitioner a 50 cm headroom for manipulation. Reticular veins on the face are much easier to treat than veins on legs of the same size due to the lower pressure regimen. Under the vein viewer digital image it is possible to find the veins and their branches giving a better notion of the venous map. This is the outcome two weeks after a single session. Here are some other examples. This particular case was treated in one session back in 2002. This shows the veins before treatment this shows the face right after treatment and here is the aspect four years after treatment. These are the results for another analog case. Documentation Documentation is paramount when treating veins of cosmetic concern. Standardized comparison is the only adequate way to follow up treatment results. This is also convenient for the patient to understand and evaluate its outcome. This table synthesizes three years of experience totalizing 220 patients with a very low rate of complications and high effectiveness.